What's up, Sina? Jam along the baseline, JC Intal over Nesto David. Sev, that was. Hello. How are you? Yes, bro. Good, good. Sorry. Sorry okay, lang. okay, lang. No Kakawi problem. Ko lang. Okay, lang. No problem. Kasama ko ngayon. My gosh. I've had legends on the show. First time <laughs> ever that I'm gonna have someone who. I've had. I, meron na pala ako retired. Si Coach Sino, Olsen Rasela. <laughs> ah, si Coach Olsen. Medyo malayo Medyo malayo naman. Malayo na yan. <laughs> Pero technically, pareho na kayo. <laughs> Please, say hi. Si Bianca nag-set up. Say hi. Hi. Na mahihain pa eh. Say Mawaw, hi. mahihain pa. <laughs> Siya pa yung mahihain. Hi daw, hi daw. Hi, hi. Sorry, he was late. Pinadali ko sa Don't worry. Narinig mo ba siya? <laughs> ah, narinig ko. <laughs> Pinagalitan ako eh. Hindi, okay lang. Hindi naman to live eh. So, pero ngayon, kasama ko ngayon, JC and Talhu. just announced his retirement. It's a Tuesday today, guys. So, dalawang araw pa lang ang lumilipas and sobrang swerte ko na. Malabang paglabas nito, lumabas na yung iba. So, okay lang yon. At least, masasabi ko lang sa lahat, nauna siya sa akin. Okay? <laughs> Pero unang-una, Kuya JC, congratulations. Thank you, bro. Salamat. Okay. Um, Maraming salamat. Uh, I can say that it caught people off guard. Maybe those who don't know you personally. Ako, sinerte lang ako na nandun ako sa Nissan event nung Tuesday. Yeah, okay. With, ano, sinerte. Uh, yeah. yeah, yeah. Uh -oh. So, sinabi niya sa akin and dun pa lang, medyo na ano na ako because um, I studied din natin na kasi when I was in grade school. Okay, malalaman natin yung edad niya dito. Grade school Thank ako. Thank you, mahal. Bye. <laughs> <laughs> Nakatapos na lang ano niya, meeting din eh. Sabi That's ko, okay. kahiram ng laptop mo. Uh, okay lang, okay lang. Ano naman eh. Adjust tayo sa wives natin. Oh, sumunod tayo yeah. kayo. No? Okay, kayo, JC. Pero yeah, I was I was an Atenean in grade school. So, when you first entered the UAB. Grade school. Oh. Atinista ako noon. So, syempre, yung mga kuya, mga college, syempre, pinapanood namin yun. I was one of your fans then hmm. uh, when you first <laughs> got into the the UAAP. Pero, unang-una, salamat sa oras mo, kuya. Pero, I'm sure, madaming, of course, of course, bro. madaming matutuwa sa story mo. And ako rin mismo, I wanna know your story. So, Tell us naman yung where it all started. How you fell in love with the game. Because you're the, ano, di ba? Kuya, the panganay. Ah, uh, no, no, no. Uh, ano kami? Pangalawa ako sa panganay. May, Pangalawa. Uh, I have five siblings. We're five boys. Uh, bunso namin, babae. Tatlo doon, basketball players before varsity. And then yung pang-apat namin and fifth, si Rex, yeah. volleyball. volleyball. Yeah. So, so, nakuha nila sa mom namin yung ano, volleyball. Naging player yung mom ko, mom namin nung college. So, where did where did it all start? Nung ano pa lang, when you were, was it a cliche basketball story na bata ka pa lang in love ka na with the game? Ah, no, no. Uh, nung grade school ako, I was into swimming, table tennis, volleyball. So, alam mo yung batang hindi mo pakali. <laughs> <laughs> Gusto lahat itry. itry. And then yung kuya ko, he's three years older. Nakita ko, nag-try out sa basketball. So medyo na-engganyo ako mag-try mag din. Since then, wala na. Non-stop basketball. Oh. Grade, I was in grade 4. Nag-try out ako. And then, yun. Grade 4, varsity, hanggang college na. Where was this nung grade school ka, kuya? Ag ano ako, Claret School kami nung kuya ko. Claret, Claret. School. So sa Claret, in Quezon City, it's either basketball or volleyball lang sport ko. Totoo. Totoo. Dalawa yeah, lang. Yung school na yun. Yeah, sila Mac Kuan, uh, Chuchu Serrano, ah. Japs Kuan. Doon din galing. Claret. Yeah, 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 sa Claret. Ubalde. Yeah. Ubalde. Ubalde bros. Yeah. So sino ang teammates mo nun? Nung time na yun? So, Meron ba na Claret. umangat din? Ah... Uh, UAP, si Arvin Braganza. UAP. Ah, okay. Si Bragi. Naging teammate Pero, ko pa si Bragi. Oh, ano siya? Lower batch sa akin. Lower batch, yeah. yeah. Uh, two, I think he's two years younger. Yeah. And then Victor Villago. Pero hindi na siya nag-UAP. San yeah. Beda. NCAA San Beda. High School. So, from grade 4, talagang ano na, in love ka na sa game. So, obviously, you were already an athlete as a child. Kasi... Kung saan-saan ka na nakabuti. <laughs> Kung ano-ano yeah, so, na tinry mo. Lahat. Kahit grade school kami, nag-ligan lab. Uh, yun, sumasali ako sa liga. Mga uh, kalaro ko nun, mga senior citizens, mga titos. Uh, <laughs> mga, alam mo yun, yung parang sama ka sa amin, dayo tayo. Uh, Asa dumadayo so, ka nung bata ka? Oh, Project 8, Project 6, lahat ng project sa QC, <laughs> dinadayo namin. Pampanga, <laughs> naglaro din kami yung Pampanga. Uh, Doon yung province namin. Mom ko naman, Bulacan. So... Grade school, high school, nakipaglaro na ako sa mga 
Manoy. Ah, so Manoy. ano ka rin? Naglalaro ka rin sa araw? Kasi guys, oh, alam oh, ko, naman. alam ko, kilala nyo JC Intal, yung atinista na, De. yung ano na, PBA <laughs> player na. Pero, De. so dati ano din talaga? Larong oh, labas. Patang larong labas din ako dati. <laughs> yung alam nila kasi yung atinista na social ni. De, de, de. <laughs> de, pero yun, doon din nag-start si Kuya JC. And, nung ano kuya, from my earliest memory of you, Let transquires. So how did that go yes, about that, that? When did it register to you na, okay, I can take this seriously and I can go to a school na may basketball program talaga? Uh, may, meron ako neighbor sa ano nun, sa Quezon City. I grew up in Quezon City. Uh, addict sa basketball. Yung brother niya naging varsity sa Lourdes, Quezon City. Yun yung sinasabi kong legal liga na parati ako sumasama. Yeah. Lika, dayo tayo. Sabi niya, may potential ka, ba't di ka mag-try out sa school na may, may NCA or UAP? That time sa Claret kasi 2CBL, PAYA, uh, yung mga leagues talaga na hindi mo, hindi ka masascout. Yeah. And then one summer, uh, second year high school ako nun. Uh, wala, sumama lang ako. Biglaan lang, sumama lang ako. Sarado yung gym ng San Beda sa Manila. Manila, Menjola. Fairview kami ah, Fairview area, boundary uh, kami natin. Sige, sama ako kuya. Pala mo sa parents ko. Saka pupunta, saka na naman pupunta. <laughs> Di, magbabasketball lang kami. Pero hindi na ng parents ko na mag-tryout. Tryout ka. So, sarado yung gym na San Beda. Sabi ko, kuya, sayang namin punta natin. Sobrang kabado pa ako nun. Pero ready na ako mag-tryout. Tara, punta tayo sa ano, sa Intramuros. Sana tayo ng gym. Yun na. Uh, ongoing yung practice ng letra nun, high school. Yung sila Ron J. Enrile, yeah. Boyd Pautista. Sabi ko, Parang mga gayot to mga to ah. Eh ako, buto-buto. Tryouts ako, nakipractice ako. Uh, the next day, pinag-enroll na ako ni Coach Jing Ruiz. Uh-uh. Yun, doon na, na nag-start. Pag-uwi ko, sabi ko, ma, uh, lilipat na ako ng school. <laughs> oh, ano yari? Dito na muna lang si Kuya Gerald. Eh, kilala nila yung neighbor namin. Yeah. Basta may nangyari. Nag-offer siya ng scholarship. So, from Claret, QC, lumipat ako intramuros. Ang layo. Layo. Sobra. Kaya going back na eh. Nareminis ako ngayon na kung paano nag-start. Basically, second year high school ka na. Kung baga, nakakalahati ka na ng high school life mo. Oo. Oh, diba? oh. Kung baga, wala talaga sa plano mo, obviously. Kasi nakakalahati ka na eh. Medyo ano wala, na, wala. pwede mo nang tapusin yung hanggang Paya Juniors ka lang oh, siguro oh. Sa, sa Claret. So you were supposed to go to San Beda. San Beda dapat. The reason why nag, nag-decide na ako mag-try yung brother ko kasi, lahat ng younger brothers ko nasa Ateneo. So, narinig ko na yung UAP that time. Ah. Yung UAP juniors. Yeah. Tinry kong lumipat ng grade 7 sa Ateneo, hindi ako pamasa. Sa school? Yeah. Sa ACADS? Sa school ng Ateneo, ah, yes. Ah, 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 ah. Sabi ko, wait lang, parang hindi para sa akin talaga to. <laughs> so, lumipat ako letran. Dapat San Beda talaga. Pero hindi ko rin, hindi ko rin naman alam eh. Coach Ato, kung magusto niyo laro ko that time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No. So, hindi ko rin alam. So you went to Menjola, walang walang tryouts wala, wala, kahit ano. Wala kami kilala, wala wala. Nagbaka sakali lang kami ongoing yung practices nila. So ikaw yung Retired. literal. Cheers muna. Sige go, yan. Gusto ko. <laughs> Retired na siya. Pwedeng pwede na. <laughs> so may iya pa ako kanina eh. Okay, okay. Wala yun. Uh, so it, ikaw ang literal na walk-in. Walk-in talaga. Oh, walk-in. Walk-in tryout. Kasi, hindi man lang ano, hindi man lang yung Oh. Uy, may tryouts daw. <laughs> Send ko to kay ano, Gerald Pereras. Nasa US na siya eh. Ah, Kaya nasa Gerald. US na siya. Uh, daming ano rin doon eh. Addict sa basketball, mga Pinoy. Sobra. Ang daming so, viewers ng channel na to uh, na ibang bansa. Nagugulat ako minsan kung uh, saan-saan umaabot yung video sa mga players. So si Kuya JC Tal, pumunta ng San Beda. Dumayo sorry. ng San Beda, wala <laughs> lang. Wala lang. Baka sakali may practice sila guys in 24 hours para masakto mo yung punta mo doon doon sa practice nila. Hindi ko alam kung paano ano nila naisip na pumunta lang doon. And then, from there, diretso kayong intramuros, letran. Letran. It took you one practice yes, for them to... Practice. Actually, that time, hindi ko makalimutan. Eh. Siri, papa ako ni Ron J. And really, yun yung type niya. <laughs> Kuya Ron J, nanonood ka ba? <laughs> High school pa lang. <laughs> De, pero ano, siya na yung narinig ko doon nung pagdating ko doon. Siya talaga. Sabi ko, star player yan. Saka si Boyet Bautista. Boyet Bautista. So... He was a senior when you came in. Uh, yes, senior. Senior, senior na siya. Yes, And you senior. were in second year pa lang. And then... Second year. In unang... coming third year, nag-residency ako one year. So one year ka lang nag-squires? One, one year lang. Kasama si J.R. Reyes. Mm-hmm. J.R. Reyes, Ray Guevara, R.J. Azul, oh, Chuck Pero yun yung mga bata. Yun yung mga bata. Oh, young boys. Wow. So O.J. If... Kua, Lasal. Yeah. O.J. Kua. So first practice mo... Ano ka na? Kumbaga, nagustuhan ka kagad, obviously. Were you always as, athlet- uh, as athletic? Or were you always athletic? Uh, not, 
Ewan ko ah. Hindi <laughs> ko. Uh, nung grade 7 kasi, alam mo yung sa school, nakaganon yung ring. Nakababa. Uh-uh. So, so nung, na, kasi uh-huh. pag grade school ka, alam mo yung top word. Sikat ka na eh. Yeah. Grade school. <laughs> Totoo. So, sabi ko, teka. After yun ng ano na yun eh. Pauwi na ako ng, school, uh, ng bahay nun. Nag-iyan mag-basketball yung mga classmates ko. Ewan ko, sobrang hyper ko. Dinang ko yung bola, grade 7. Grade 7. Sabi ko, teka. Okay to ah. <laughs> Yun teka, na, yun, hindi, doon, doon, doon ako na-addict sa basketball. Teka, hindi normal to ah. Grade 7 yeah. pa lang ah. Siguro ngayon yeah. normal na yun. Pero nung panahon... Oo, dami ngayon. Nakikita ko. Grabe. Dati, umabot lang yung kamay mo sa net. Top net, top ring lang. Ay, top, top board, board lang. Okay na eh. Oo. Okay ka na. Lalo na pag grade 7. Pakal pa yung board doon pag tumunog yun. <laughs> pero yeah, dati nga grade 7, it would... Hindi, hindi, hindi iniisip dumunk ng mga grade oh. 7 students. So, pero nakaganon yung ring ah. <laughs> Okay, he is being Nakababa. nice. Medyo mabait pa siya. Nakaganan daw yung ring kaya yung dadak. Uh, Pero kuya, so, when you entered uh, Letran, this was your first taste of, hindi naman competitive basketball. Pero at that level, na talaga NCAA. Uh-oh. Diba? Like we were saying, pag claret kasi, paya, and then yung mga ganong leagues, iba yung NC. And NC during that time was, pisikalan yung NC ng time na yun. Diba? So, what was the adjustment for you from going, for going from a small basketball school to, uh, to an NCAA diba, school? Uh, that time kasi, uh, nung third year high school ako, nagkaroon ako ng body-body, si J.R. Reyes yun. So, ang usapan namin, pag may tumira sa'yo, titirahin mo rin. Ano ba, may tumira sa'kin, titirahin niya. Parang naging ano kami nun eh, parang nagkasundo kami na, parang ganun, alam mo yung, pag may madumi laro, tirahin mo, padaanin mo sa'yo. So, ako, kumpiyansa na ako nun, na kahit, physicalan yung laro. Alam Meron. ko may bisasalo sa akin. Kasi ako, hindi ako tako gulo eh. Uh-huh. Alam mo yung, yung time na yun, naalala ko lang. And then, nung fourth year namin ni JR, pinapasabay na kami sa senior practices. Kaya medyo na ano na ako, nasanay na ako sa mga, medyo mas malalaki sa akin mm-hmm. na and when you say seniors during that time sa Letran, those were si Ron J. Ron J, uh, Orlan Boyet. Tama, Kirby, uh, no, no, yes, Boyet, uh, Billy Moody. Billy Moody. Billy Moody. Uh, uh, <laughs> Billy Moody, guys. Nandun pa ba si Ismael Junio? Junio. Junio nandun. Yung sobrang batak na, <laughs> batak. sabi ko, super jump shot. <laughs> super Kasi jump shot. Super jump shot na player na. Grabe. PBL days niya, grabe. Kung Ismael Junio. Sayang Junio. lang hindi siya nakapag-BBA. Yeah, but he was... He was legit during that time. Wait, Sobrang what year was ito. this? 2000? Nung... 2000... Ano ako no? 2005? Ah, 6. Ah, 5. 5. 2005. 2005, you were in sa juniors? Yes. 2006, nag-UAP, ano na ako nun. Rookie year ko nung college. Nung college, 2006. Grabe, no? 2006 <laughs> ka nag-college? Rookie year. Ah, no, 2002. No. Sorry, 2002. 2002. 2002. So, 2001 to? 2001 high school. Senior, ah. yes, yes. 2006 ako nag-graduate. Yeah. So, sino ang kalaban mo nung time na yun sa junior? Sina Arjun Cordero? Ar- Arjun, abutan ko. Um, rest in peace. Ano? Tabike. Tabike, yeah. Rest in peace. Tabike. Yeah. Nag-UP yun. Tabike. Nag-UP, yeah. Nag-UP, yeah. Nag-UP. Nestor David. Nestor David. Matindi rin yung ano mo. And, Benitez, Lasal. So, you played one season lang officially sa Letran? One season lang nung high school. Uh, was that a great season was that a mythical team season? Guys? Yes, oh, we won the championship ah, noong time. Ayan, naman pala After 14 years, hindi nag-champ, 14 years hindi nag-champion ng Letran. Nag, ah. Nag-champion kami. Rookie MVP si JR Reyes. Ah, That's tapos a, ikaw, mythical. Mythical. Denominate ni JR yung, ah. yung, yung high school. Ano, Kaya six, naman pala. 6-7 six, isang... siya noong time na yun. Sobrang dominate, dominant. Yeah. Ano talaga, big man. Uh, so, it, was, it took you one season, obviously, to make a name for yourself, at least sa juniors. And then, nag ensayo ko na si seniors noon. Sa letran. Sa letran. Oh. Oh. So, paano oh. ka nasungkit? <laughs> 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 Yun ang tanong ko kasi, I'm sure, yung letran nights noon, okay, sa amin pupunta si J.R. Reyes oh. si J.C. Intal. Oh. And, sorry, pero kuya, wala pang ano nito ah. Wala pang pera-pera nito nung time na to. Wala pa. Sigurado ano lang, wala pa. Meal allowance lang. Meal allowance <laughs> lang. So, paano ka nasungkit ng Ateneo? Ateneo, uh, it was ano, Father Tito Kaluwag and Coach Joel Banal. Talagang they were so, ano talaga, persistent. Kasi yung mga kapatid ko noon, nasa Ateneo na eh. Yeah. And nung grade 7 ako, gusto ko na lumipat ng Ateneo. So, ano ka na? So, sabi ko, wow, sobrang laking blessing na ito na pala. Ito pala yung... Path. 
Oo, pa. And then, hindi ko na may-mention ibang school. Hindi, Pero... may-mention mention mo, kuya. Mention mo na, kuya. Retired okay. ka na eh. Huwag kwento na lang. Sinong, na, eh. sinong teams ako mukuha sa'yo nun for college? Uh, hindi ako nag-iayabang ha. Kasi medyo may sablay yung decision namin nun eh. Nag-commit kami ni, sorry, JR. Nag-commit kami ni JR sa Lasal. Bakit wala kang nag-Lasal sa inyong dalawa? <laughs> uh, anong nangyari nun? Championship ng Lasal versus Ateneo, 2001. Nag-champion na siya. Pumunta kami ng victory party. What? Tapos tinawag kami sa stage. Pinakalala kami sa mga, ano, sa mga alumni, alumnos. Uh, this is uh, rookie, ganyan, ganyan. Sorry, Coach Franza. <laughs> yun niya. Sabi ko sa parents ko, kinuyento ko yung nangyari. Ganyan, ganyan. Oh, kala ba gusto mo mag-Ateneo? Ano nangyari? Hindi kasi, ano eh, pinakalala na kami ganyan sa stage. Eh, idol ko pa si Mike Cortez. Yeah. Noong 2001, humingi ako ng jersey na Mike Cortez. Binigay sa akin yung championship jersey. Yan na. Yes! Maglalasal ako. Maglalasal ako. Tapos, Coach Joel, Father Tito, they went to our house in Quezon City. Dinner. Sabi ko, Father, paano yan? Nag-commit na ako sa alasal. Eh, syempre, medyo bata pa. ba? Diba? Yung yeah. decision, hindi yan eh. Hindi ako nag-consult sa parents. Pero yan eh. Okay lang yan. Sabi mo... <laughs> Sabi mo yung mga kapatid mo nasa atin eh. Yeah. Yun, 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 yun. Siyempre, nagsasabihin nila, okay lang yan. Dito ka na oh. lang. <laughs> oh. <laughs> um, pero sa atin eh, oh, kahit nirecruit ako, kami ni Jerry, nag-tryouts pa rin kami. Sobrang dami rin nilang nirecruit noong time ah, yeah. 2002. Wait, so... Sina Doug, Sina Kramer, Doug, yeah. from Baguio, Zach yeah. Estrosa from Cebu, cousin so, of Don Tono Tiveros. So... Yun yung disadvantage ng wala pang cellphone nung time na yun eh. At wala pang media. So, nung niligawan ko ni Coach Joel, hindi na timbre yan ni Coach Franz. Then, buti na lang din. Kung hindi, di ba? Ah, sa kakutak na, sa kakutak na bashers yun. Kung ngayon nangyari yun, oh, magulo yun. Grabe yun. <laughs> Wait, Pero so buti hindi... nga, pwede na ikwento ngayon eh. So, hindi mo na ever binalikan si Coach Fran? I think nagpaalam naman ako. Paalam na. Doon sa parang kay Aw. Nung yeah, yeah. Kay, kay, kay uh, Boss Aw. Lakson. Ko, nag-sorry ako na. Ano, sabi ko. Next-train ko na lang na. Matagal ko nung dream lumipat ng atin eh. <laughs> Malamang ngayon may video ka pa na nandun ka sa stage ng Lasa. <laughs> Oo. Oh, oh. <laughs> Kung ngayon nangyari. <laughs> Pero sobrang thankful ako. Nakakuha ko ng Mike, Mike Cortez jersey, championship jersey 2001. Diba? Um, buti hindi pa niya binawi sa'yo. <laughs> Nakalaba mo pa siya. <laughs> Punit pa nga yun eh. Punit pa yung jersey na yun eh. Parang kinalmot yata ni Westy yung jersey. <laughs> so, wow. So, JC Intal was supposed um, to be an archer. Oo. Oh. I know, hindi, hindi na dapat ikaw tinatanong ko nito. Bakit si JR napunta ng UP? Yun na, isa pa yun. Nag-worth ako JR. Uh, ano kami nun eh? Nasa letran kami ng classroom. May eraser kami. May eraser. So, sinusulat namin ng Ateneo and then sa likod na sal. Hagis namin yun. Sasaloyin namin. So, Ateneo. Siya, Lasal. Tapos nag-gulat ako nag-UP. <laughs> Tapos mag-dorm kami noon. Punta kami sa dorm. Ready na kami lumipat. Biglang tumawag sa akin. Ay, napaps mag-UP ako. Hindi ko na pinigilan. Nalungkot ako. Pero, syempre, best friend ko nung high school. Hindi ko na pinigilan. Wait, 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 wait. wait. Papunta na dapat siyang Lasal. Ateneo. Ah, mag-Ateneo dapat siya. So, kinuha oh, din siya. Kinuha din siya. Mag-dorm na dapat kami sa Ateneo sabay. Ah. And then, biglang tumawag sa akin. Nilipat na kami ng dorm pwede ito tumawag siya na mag-UP na ako. So, package deal din dapat kayo? Dapat, dapat. Dapat. And oh, then, Jay. nasungkit naman siya ng UP. UP. Coach Alan Gregorio. Coach, oh, iba yun. <laughs> Ay, wala. Nakausap yun. <laughs> Ay, Coach Alan, salamat sa tweet mo. Maraming salamat. Si Coach Alan, pag nakakausap ng tao yun, magbabago isip ng tao kahit ano uh, pa yun. <laughs> bait, bait na coach. Oh, bait din si Coach. So, wait. So, ano na rin talaga? Kumbaga, when he was, when you were talking to Ateneo, kasama na rin si Jernon. So talagang hindi dapat kayo mag-iwalay. Hindi, hindi dapat. Pero syempre, um, I'm sure, uh, matured na siya nung tayo na yun and may decision yeah, sa early years. And, he did, he, did, and uh, he did have a great career with UP. Yun yung ano yun. Nung time na yun, yun yung malakas pa yung UP. ba? Diba? So, uh, <laughs> ano din? Malakas na lalo ngayon. Ano, ngayon, malakas. Then, nagka, yeah. nagka-time in between kasi, aka kami. Yes. Pero like before, <laughs> so, okay sila. Ito rin again, a disadvantage of not having cell phones nung time na yun. Hindi na niya nabalitaan. <laughs> Usually, araw-araw, magka-viber kayo or yeah. magka-text kayo na uh, <laughs> balita, di ba? Wala. So, nagulat ka na lang. Okay, uh, so, when you transferred to, when you went to Ateneo, Was it a big adjustment again? Because you're going from, again, Claret is a small basketball school. You went to Letran. Now, Letran is a big basketball school, but 
it's still not as a big a school as Ateneo. Diba? I know na meron ka ng medyo familiar ka na sa Ateneo because your younger brothers uh, studied there. Pero was it a big adjustment again? Campus pa lang eh. <laughs> yes, sobra. As in, na-culture shock ako. Imagine from the Red Caption City, the transfer to Letran, na sobrang... Wait, nasa mundo ko. Kasi Intramuros eh. Intramuros. Gulo. Pero magandang school. Pero magulo sa Intramuros. Pero imagine from Letran to Ateneo. Alam mo na may ibig sabihin, di ba? Yeah. Na ang laki ng campus. Uh, tapos bago pa yung Moro Lorenzo noon. Dami Bang chicks. Na joke lang. Uh, <laughs> Nagre-reminish tayo. Ng, pwede pa tayo mag-usap. Ang laki ng adjustment eh. Kasi unang-una, ang pinakabado ko, sa academics. So you weren't the best student. Hindi naman ako student. bagsak. Hindi ako bagsak uh, na You just student, weren't ha? the best student. Yung sakto student, lang. Yeah. Hindi ako 75 na. Sa 85 ako 90. Hindi ako like nerd. Yeah. Hindi rin ako <laughs> hindi rin ako pasaway na studyante. Pero kinabahan ako first year. Ang dami kinarinig na varsity players na dito matagal. Yeah. True. And then nung, nung nirecruit kami ng Ateneo hindi hindi di ko alam na hindi pala automatic kami malaline up. Kailangan namin mag-try out. So sabi ko sa parents ko, magandang ano rin, para magandang challenge din. If talaga itutuloy-tuloy ko yung UAP, magandang challenge if makukuha ko ng rookie year. Uh, so hindi ka assured? Hindi, hindi talaga. Ang dami na may recruits noon. From, four guys from Cebu, Doug Kramer from Baguio, two Australians, and then ako and JRR and some other yeah. guys. Sa Lasal noon, sure ka? Yata. Ayoko mag-assume, pero yata. Uh, tapang mo din. So, talagang laban-laban na. Oo, oh, laban-laban. <laughs> UP, <laughs> hindi ka rin, hindi ka na kinuha na. Hindi ka Actually, hindi ako kinuha na UP. Yung, okay, so, Atina yung Lasal. So, you had a choice between Lasal na medyo sure na barring uh, kung mag-text man si Coach Franz at sabihin ngayon. And then, uh, di sigurado yan si Jason. Oo, wala, wala. De, pero like, Lasal or Atina yun, na talagang tryouts ka. Yes, And so, you were already committed to Atina yun. No, na, nasa... Yes, nag-commit na ako nun. Commit ka na nun. Nag-enroll na ako nun. Yeah. And na ako nun this was... This 2002. was... Wesley Gonzalez, Larry Fonacher. Larry Fonacher, Jack Chia. Jack Chia. Enrico. Rich Alvarez, Enrico. LA was still there. LA. LA. Uh, Chris Kimpo, Gerald Mido. Sino kalaban mo sa spot? Wesley and Larry. No, I mean like the backup spot. <laughs> uh, I think Jack. That Jack, time. yeah. And... Some isa pa. But, but what was that like? Uh, na, yun nga, ga, coming from a, an NCAA school juniors, tapos ito na, naka, naging kakampi mo yung mga pure Ateneans. Oo, oh, na starstruck ako sa mga yun. <laughs> Larry po na siya. Larry po na siya. Rich Alvarez, kala ko, lakas ko nang dumak itong high school eh. Si Rich Alvarez, dinakdakan ako nung first day yata nung practice na. Ano. <laughs> Hindi ko makakalimutan yun. So, paano yun? Like, ito yung mga pure Ateneans. Yes. Uh, sila Larry. Larry and Rico. Si Rich kasi recruited din from Japan. Yeah, pero si Enrico, si Larry, si Wesley. Ay, Wes. Wesley. Oh, Wes. Tama. Oh, si Wes. Papi so Wes. How, oh, so how was that adjustment? Sa- Asarap ng beer. Oh, Isang bote lang ako ah. Ang galing. Baka alam nyo, manginom ako. Hindi. Ngayon lang. Pwede na, retard. <laughs> One so bottle how was, lang. How was that experience with the team naman? Like, basketball-wise. Being under Coach Joel Banala, who was a legendary coach, even during that time, or so now. Oh, first year with Coach Joel, ano? Uh, he was so strict pero alam mong may pupuntahan yung team namin plus the lineup kasi sobrang kumpiyahan sa kaya na ang lalakas ang teammates mo parang mahi- mahina na yung final four nung yung, alam mo yung yeah. gets mo and then talo sila nung 2001 against the South so they were so motivated we were so motivated to enter the finals again ng UAP uh-uh. and so kami were... taga cheer kami the dog <laughs> after the warm up uh, that's it for today pupu na tayo <laughs> so yun yung role namin nung rookie year mag cheer sa kanila And then, pero, dun, dun, champion din. Pero warm-up, dunk ka na ng dunk doon, siyempre. Oh, yeah. Doon lang, doon lang tayo nagko-practice, eh. <laughs> <laughs> Nagwawala tao noon kada dunk mo. Uh, <laughs> And yeah, that was... Yeah, time din. So, talagang hindi ka rin nakatapak. Hindi ka rin nakakalaro masyadong. Ah, nakakalaro din naman. Pero not here. as, ano uh, lang. A few minutes lang. Pero uh, I, I knew my role. Let's go on. Lose his control, but it's not right there. What a easy slam. Slam number two for the Blue Eagles. Easy does it for JT. Here's the gem, Jude. Well, here's the thing. Born and Sin was right there, but look at this. Three blue shirts. And Intel, of course, the reception. gets it all the way to Intel. This oh, time, oh, yeah. it's not way ahead of Intel, and he slams it home. USD versus FAU. Well, ladies and gentlemen, Ateneo, thanks to slam dunks by GC Intel, just like this one, wins it by... How about sa school? 
Kumusta yung ano? Ah, yung, first year, may yung, struggle ano ng konti. Sa school? Hindi school academics, like sa school, oh. sa campus. Campus. Yung adjustment mo, laki ng campus sa atin eh. Wala, ano ako, uh, tahimik lang ako sa school. Ah, may bilang, pagka-loner bilang, ka nun. Loner ako nung, nung college. Bilang lang kaibigan ko. Sobrang mayayain ako eh. As in, ah, akala mo suplado or mayabang. Pero hindi ako sanay makipag-usap sa mga tao nung college. Talaga? And, yeah, yung mga nakakasama ko lang sa dorm. Sabay kami punta ng school, sa classroom. Wala, upo ka lang. Yung sulok. Doon kami sa pinakalikod. Basketball na basketball. <laughs> yung malalaki na pag pumasok, sulok lang likod. Pero ganun. proud ako, di ako natutulog sa classroom. Nagising ka naman. Nagising <laughs> naman. <laughs> so, Social life mo nun, wala din. Relax ka lang talaga. Wala, wala. Ang ano lang namin nun, school, dorm, and then matakaw ako sa nap, afternoon nap, after school, then training na, afternoon. Sa gabi, papers, review, and then counter-strike. No, uh, red uh, alert. Yeah, yeah, red yeah, alert yeah, yeah. sa gabi. And then sa blue school, skies. Sa blue skies. Blue skies. Blue skies. Grabe. Boy pa ba yun? Yan lang yung mundo namin. Yan lang yung mundo namin. Yan lang talaga yung mundo mo o dahil baka nakikinig ano? lang si wife mo? Hindi. Yan, yan, yan lang yung mundo namin. <laughs> Good boy. Yung mundo namin nung ano, Good boy pa si ano. Good boy pa si Kuya JC. So talagang basketball. Uh, basketball um, school. School. Konting oh. counter-strike, red alert, battle yes, realms, alert. ganyan. Oh, Friendster. <laughs> Friendster. <laughs> send ng ano, send ng uh, test, di, testy. Hindi <laughs> alam ng mga viewers mo yung Friendster. Hindi <laughs> <laughs> alam. Merong mga karelate. May mga send testy ah, meron, pa. Meron, meron, meron. <laughs> meron naman. May mga karelate. Pero halos lahat wala. Facebook na eh. Bang, hindi nga ata the ones that multiply yung mga viewers MySpace. ko eh. MySpace. MySpace. Pupunta ka pa ng computer shop baka pag Friendster lang. <laughs> oh, Friendster. Yun, yun ang ano. Kasi walking distance na sa dorm namin yung time na yun. Yeah. But... Did you keep a, a, a relationship with JR? I mean, like, nakikita kayo kasi lapit lang eh. Ah, yes. Oo. Oh, oh. uh, so, uh, ano rin kayo? Nanonood ako ng games niya ng UP. I don't know if nanonood siya ng game namin ng Ateneo. So, pupunta rin ng UP if mo food trip ka din doon? Ah, hindi. Uh, after Ateneo na na nag-graduate. Doon ko lang narinig yung mga ano doon. Ah, hindi ka pupunta doon, Joe. Hindi, hindi. So, ah, ba? talagang chill ka. Hindi rin ako malabas ng college eh. So, hindi ka maano, ma... Ano, ma- Ano ba yung embassy? Wala ako. Ma-embassy. Siguro bilang lang sa kamay. <laughs> yun yung uso yes. dati. Embassy. After ko mag-dorm, uwi ako sa bahay namin sa Crescent City Weekend. Yun lang. Ah, so sobrang ano ka, quiet. Bas- wala, hindi ako lumalabas. Pero nung, siguro nung after na season ng UAP, doon kami lumalabas. Uh-oh. Pero bilang lang sa kamay. Bilang lang sa kamay. Uh-oh. So you really like basketball? Basketball lang talaga. Uh, and then, no ano. And school. The first... Kailangan ko mag-graduate talaga, college. Hindi pwedeng hindi. So how is that? How is that like no? I mean, rookie season champion. Kaka-champion mo lang ng Letran, champion uh-huh. na naman ng Ateneo on your first season. Uh-huh. And that was Ateneo's first championship in matagal. Yes, years uh, more than years. 10 years din yata. Yeah, yeah, kasi yung buong grade school life ko parang hindi nag-champion Ateneo. 2000 Uh-oh. Hindi nag-champion Ateneo noon. Like 97 ako pumasok eh hanggang 2005. No, yun lang ang nag-champion. How was it like nung ano? nung first championship mo. Kasi alam ko naman na hindi siya kasing special sa iyo just because first year mo hindi ka naman atinista na hindi mo naman inintay yun for like how many years. Pero like how special was it to have a championship agad personally on your first season? Uh, kakaibang feeling of course kasi uh, yung training namin nung summer na yun as in Talagang grabe, nag-twice a day kami noon, nung time na yun, first time ko mag-twice a day. Kasi high school wala namang ganun eh. And then, alam mo yung talagang pinagpaguro ng team ng time na yun. Gustong-gusto nilang bumawit sa lasal. Yun, sabi, sabi ko nga kay Doug, sobrang swerte natin, rookie, nag-champion tayo kahit hindi tayo masyadong gabit. Oo, hindi. Tsaka... Magandang buwelo yun. Magandang buwelo sa second year namin sa atin eh. Yeah, and parang ang feeling ko nun, parang hindi kayo ganun ka... Kayo, kayong mga rookies, hindi kayo ganun ka... Kasi sila, may, may dala sila from the previous year eh. Oo. Oh, may yes. dala silang galit eh. <laughs> diba? Oo, oh, 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 naman. Oh, naman. So kayo, parang ano, nagulat na lang din kayo na talagang mainit sila. And I'm sure nga, talagang the whole year, mainit sila, diba? But how was it when when you came in and then you started playing with Wesley, Larry? Sino yung mga, sino mga nanira sa'yo eh? Magandang tanong. No, 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 wala, wala naman, wala naman. Wala naman ano doon. Uh, si ano, Enrico, medyo... <laughs> <laughs> Pero grabe, Enrico kasi sobrang ibang ibang klaseng captain ball yung time niya. And talagang siya nag siya nagbuhat sa amin nung 2002. Totoo, totoo. Iba yung iba yung talagang lalo na nung nag-champion kami. Grabe. Yung the whole Ateneo community as in para kami mga celebrities yung time noon. 
Sobra. Imagine rookie rookies kami ah. Mga grade school, papapirma sa amin Totoo. yung mga... May bonfire. Sabi ko, no? ganito, bonfire. Sabi ko, grab, ganito pala dito. So, mas lalo na in love ako sa basketball. Yung inspiration mo, bibigay sa mga bata. Imagine first year college, tapos may mga ganun na. So, nakaka-inspire. Sobrang ano. Yeah, so ikaw lang ang tanging nandun sa Lasal bonfire. Tapos nasa Ateneo bonfire the next year. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> nag-celebrate siya kasama Lasal tapos nag-celebrate so, siya sa <laughs> Mateneo <laughs> Tibay <laughs> sa mga Lasal alumni ngayon na dapat pala sa inyo si Kuya JC nasungkit lang eh. <laughs> nasungkit nasungkit and so, then yeah. ito yung earliest memory ko personally when I was in 2006 ata to 2006 Nike Summer League Nike. Ah, oh, Nike. No. Sa Eyak. Di ba yun yung laruan doon sa Eyak? Yung... Eyak, yes, yes. Oh, tama, uh, tama. Uh, so, ano ko noon? The sec- school of ano, Ron J. Buenafe. Ron J. Buenafe. So, I was uh, a... Second year high school. So, doon ako sa juniors. Obviously, ang Nike Summer League. And then, di ba, sinasabi ko nga pag Summer League, di ba, sunod-sunod yung games. Sunod-sunod oh, lang. Oh. Tapos ang, manu- uh, yeah. ang mga nanonood lang naman talaga is yung game before mo tsaka yung after mo. Di ba? Ganun lang yun. Yes. Bipihis ka lang sandali, labas ka na agad, dala mo bag mo. Lagay sa ilalim yeah. ng bench, laro na kayo, tapos uwi ka na after. Uh, so nandun ako, second year ako noon. Upo ako, kaka-champion nyo lang ata noon. Ah, hindi naman. Pero ano ka, senior ka na noon. So I was, uh, I was watching you already. Pero yun yung first time na nakita ka ta live. Kayo ni na Maki Escalona noon. Tapos second year high school ako noon. Okay. Break, 3 on 2. Nasa gitna ka. Tapos bigla ka lumipad, galing ng ano, siguro dotted line. You won't remember this. Ilang pes mo na itong ginagawa, sigurado. Basta lumipad ka dotted line, puta, tapos nag-stretch ka ng ganun. Tapos pag-dunk mo nung ganun, di syempre yung buong nanonood nga, wala namang fans eh. They were all basketball players lang din na naglaro before nyo, tsaka kami after nyo. So nagwala lahat. Kami, mga player, high school kami, <laughs> doon ako na wala ako nalala nagwala wala wala <laughs> nagwala kami 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 nagbubulungan wala, wala. kami sabi ko ganyan ba sa college parang ngayon ko na mag college <laughs> so yun yung earliest memory ko lang ng live na panood kita na talagang nag ano ka lang wala Nakanda sinashare ko lang game. baka na oh. baka sobrang kape lang ako noon sobrang <laughs> black coffee <laughs> but I always I believe this talaga na nag champion ka ng 2003 2003 2003 tapos kasama ka dun sa natalo nung 2006. Yes. Yes, the one yung UST one. Yes, But that was UST. your final year. How final was, shot, talo. Uh, uh, how was that naman nung... Kasi you you were winning or you won the chip. Nakaupo ka pa nun. But your like, yung ikaw talaga yung you were the man. Fourth year, fifth year mo. Di ba? So Sobra how was sakit that? Yun. 2006, sobrang yeah. sakit nun. Uh, that year, 2006, walang lasal nun. Yeah. Uh, they were suspended. Sabi ko medyo parang hindi complete yung UAP experience pag wala na sal. And then 2006 we lost to UST game 3, do or die game overtime. Yeah. Last shot. Imagine one one month straight hindi ako matulog ng maayos. The next day after our game I went to our province, nag ibang scenery ako, ibang perspective. As in hindi ako makatulog. Even the night that night the next day wala gising ako wala binabalik ko sa isip ko yung shot final shot. alin yung one hand na boarding yeah. na nandun na yung bola lumabas you were down one di ba yes we were down alam ko yung time na yun naalala mo pa hanggang ngayon naalala naalala ko I saw nandun ako sa three point area drive ako sa right buhat wala 12.5 seconds remaining in overtime. Maracosta the inbound. Everybody amply covered. Intal gets to it. Intal looking at the clock. Nine seconds. Intal drives hard. Last shot. Misses it. Intal takes it. It's a jump. It will go to USD. Tsaka yun yung tira mo talaga. That was your shot. Wala. So brown. Wala. Yun yun eh. Yun 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 yun. That was the Jojo Dunsil versus JC Intal finals. Jojo Dunsil, Jerby Cruz, Jerby Cruz, Ibangalista, Chapskuan. Chapskuan. Grabe rin din lineup nila. Grabe din. Grabe lineup. Nila. Yeah, grabe din. And that was the year nga na walang lasal. So kaming mga yes. lasalista na nung time na yun, business na ako nun, uh, UST ang sinichir yeah, yeah. namin nun. <laughs> grabe. 
<laughs> grabe. Yung, yung crowd ng UST and Ateneo, I think compared to 2002 Ateneo Lasal, for me, mas grabe yung crowd ng 2006 UST and Ateneo. Going to work, and the crowd knows it too. Here's Intala, isolated. Isolated! Good score! I am ready for defense there on the part of Dylan Ababu. Jervy Cruz slapped with a fifth personal foul because Ababu gave the right side to JC Intal. And Intal, known as the Rocket, will make USD pay. Look at those. USD din kasi, grabe din yung crowd. Grabe USD. Grabe USD. And JC Intal will prepare for the Slimma Jamma. And another poster shot. For the rocket, our cannon power shot, fast break. And here comes JC checking the opposition if there was anything behind him. He flushes it down. JC and Tal, 22 points. Game 2, tamba kami. That time, October, bumabag yun nun eh. Nas, nag, na, Na-cancel yung game, nung game 2. Uh, siguro after 5 days, naglaro ulit kami game 2. Tamba kami, USD. Do you think Tapos, that... Do you think that if the game wasn't postponed, medyo mas may ano? No, no, no. Wala well, lang factor yun. Oh, wala. Factor yun. And then, game two, tatamba kami sa locker room. Chinalans ko si Maki. Tapos kalawa na. Gusto niya mag-champion. Maki, magpakita ka. Game three, grabe. 28 points, 32 points. <laughs> <laughs> ah, minamala siya first two games? Hindi, game one, he was present. Game two, wala siya. Game three, grabe. How I wish na lang nag-take ng final shot. Hindi, grabe. Ang init na mga kay Escalona. Uh, yeah. yeah si diba? Ako, hindi naman ako, like, co- nung college, hindi naman ako buha ako eh. Pero sana, I don't know, Coach Norman, sana binigay mo na kay Maki yung last play. <laughs> ano ba yung last play talaga bigay nyo kay JC tapos get out of his Wala, play? Wala, isotop. Isotop nun. Siyempre, gusto ko yung moment na yun. No, pero man. wala, mintis eh. Pero si Maki yung mainit nun. Si Maki yung mainit, mainit nun. If you would have made that shot naman, putya. Siguro uh-huh. hanggang ngayon, putya. <laughs> Naaalala mo din. Kaya parang yung interview eh. Parang may namatay silang teammate noong year na yun eh, sa USD. Kaya uh-huh. yung interview nila Dylan Ababo and ano eh, Jervy at parang sabi nila Dylan, para sa kanila daw talaga eh, 2006. Nakalain na piyata yung teammate na nang namatay. Ito naman. Hmm, okay na rin. Ito yeah. naman. Hindi naman. Those were the days. Hindi na masaya. Hindi na masama yung nangyari sa sa'yo after nun. <laughs> Hindi na masama. Huwag na natin pagsisihan niya. <laughs> dami ko na lang narinig nun eh. Na, oh, buti na lang walang social media nun, di ba? Ay, nako ko may social Tatay media tayo. nun. Diyan. Tako. Penta, hinulog, magkano binayad sa'yo. Di ba? <laughs> Alam mo na yun. Ay, Ngayon nga, kahit ma-shoot mo, benta ka eh. <laughs> benta ka pa rin. Di ba? <laughs> Yun pang mintis. <laughs> Short three for Dylan Intal and a flush. JC Intal. The two three zone is a fast break. For sure, two points for you, and it's her three point play opportunity here for the streaking Blue Eagles. But how was that? I know you from Coach Joel to Coach Sandy to Coach Norman. Like your coaches naman. Kasi those are three. Kahit si Coach Sandy, underrated si Coach Sandy. Underrated. Yes, underrated. sobra. Coach Sandy, sobra. Sober underrated. How was that, naman so, yung, those those years with those coaches? How did that prepare you for the PBA? Actually, um, nag consider ng PBA in 2003. Noong time na pumasok lang ng PBL. Wait, wait, wait. This was 2003 your kasi, second year. Third year. Third year. June, third year. Nag PBL na ako ng third year. Nagkaroon ng team yung Ateneo nun. Ateneo Lee Pipes. Um, yep, Lee Pipes. And then, the third year, PBL. May nakakalaro na kami ng mga XPBA. So, syempre, alam ko na yung mga pangalan nila na. So, wait lang, medyo nakasabay tayo. Ganyan. Tapos, yung coaches time and time na si Coach Andy, Coach Joel, Coach Norman, binibigyan kami talaga ng confidence. Sige, makipagsabayan ka. Hindi ka manalabas nun. Kahit may turnover kami, wala. Go. PBL talaga kasi. Talaga hayaan ka nila eh. Makipagsabayan sa mga ex-pro, mga amateur. Ang laking ano nun, blessing ng PBL. At uh, PBA D-League na ngayon. Sobrang laking bagay nun. Pero iba yung PBL Sobra. dati. Iba yung PBL dati. dati. <laughs> De, sorry ha, pero iba talaga yung PBL. Iba nga. Lahat ng nakausap ko dito iba yung PBL. Polly, sa PBL daw talaga siya na. Iba. Ren Ren Ritualo, PBL daw talaga. Doon ako nag-consider na, ano, na mag-PBA. Third year college. Doon ko na na-shift yung focus ko. Akala ko lang tatapusin ko yung year, five years ko sa Ateneo. Pero in third year, 
sabi sa akin ni Coach Gene Afaben, assistant coach at Ateneo. Well, head coach, wala nagsabi sa akin kaya mag-PBA. Ah. Well, uh, coach Gene Afable. Ano yun eh, before ng practice, may ligang mag-shooting-shooting. O ito, poste ka, magamit mo sa PBA. Magamit mo sa PBA yan. Sabi ko, third year college, alam niya napupunta ako doon. Sh- yeah. Hindi ko makakalimutin si Coach Gene. Hindi niya alam to, pero yun yung tumatak sa utak ko noong time na yun. Na magamit mo sa pro. Itong move na to, sa poste, yeah. poste ka. Poste mo yung mga wingman na mas maliit sa'yo. Which? Yun, that year. Yeah, which in yeah, your head, ano lang. Ko PBA na nun. So which siguro so, na sabi lang niya or no. Ah, in baka in passing. Head coach ko dati. Head coach mga head coaches ko nung college wala. I don't know with coach Norman. I don't know with coach Norman. I'm sure hindi na sinasabi sa akin ko no. Pero coach Gene, siya yung talaga nakita sa akin third year na magamit mo sa pro. So that time talaga yung utak ko nasa PBA na third year college. Third college. Doon lang. Doon so lang. when you were younger ano ka lang, baga wala magka-college basketball lang ko enjoy ko yung UAAP ko. Oh. Yun, yun. Ganun, ganun. Kasi that time, nakamapalong din sina, sina Renan Retualo, Lasal, yeah. PBL, Wellcoat. <laughs> Napapanood ko na sila noon. So, so na, ano, time na. Doon mo na gauge na, okay, kaya ko mag-PBA. <clears throat> And then, what happened? Ba't hindi ka nagpa-draft na? Tinuloy mo na lang sa atin na yung... When? when? Noong 2003, sabi mo gusto mo na mag-PBA. Ah, no, 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 no. Hindi. Of course, hindi ko pa kaya noon. Sinabi rin ng ah, assistant coach Hindi, namin, sabi mo kasi nakakasabay ka na sa PBL. So sabi mo, baka hindi, kaya ko na. Hindi, hindi. Alam ko, third year yun. gusto na niya magpa-draft. Eh. Hindi, imposible yun. Hindi, no third year lang. Nag-shift sabi lang sabi, yung utak mo. Magagamit mo to sa, sa PBA in the future. Okay. So doon ka lang nag, okay, ko gusto ko mag-PBA. Wala ko, puta, imposible. <laughs> imposible yun, third year mag-PBA ka. Imposible. Bakit hindi? <laughs> Tumatalo ka gano'ng kataas tapos binapangga mo lahat. Okay, Bakit hindi? <laughs> Mababali buto ko sa PBA nun. Maaabutan mo siguro nun yung mga talagang ano. <laughs> Mababali buto ko nun sa PBA. <laughs> so, your mindset was turned on third year. Na talagang, year. okay, PBA. Ang na ang goal ko, mag-PBA. Goal mo mag-PBA. Go- mag-PBA. So, what was it like when? I'm sure, nung we talked about your missed uh, game winner supposedly. How long was it na naka-recover ka from that into, okay, shift ko yung utak ko, draft na ako? Uh, after a week, after a week to game three, no UAP finals, I got a call from Coach Chot Reyes. After a week? Oo. Uh, nung sabi natalo? Niya, yes. Sabi niya, uh, sumabay ka sa amin sa practices sa San Miguel. So, sumabay ako. Nandun si Wesley pa nun eh. Uh-huh. Wesley, sila... Chris Calagio. Olsen. Uh, Olsen. Dorian Peña. Dorian Peña. Danny, Danny Siegel. Ay, Danny Siegel. Oh my gosh. Okay. Kung siya pagpasok ko ng gym nun sa Acropolis, gusto ko kagad magpapirma eh. Eh Danny Star- Siegel kasi grade, grade school pa lang ako, napapanood ko na yun eh. Idol ko talaga yun eh. Starstruck na naman. Siya talaga yung PBA, number one PBA idol ko, ah, Danny, Danny Siegel. Siegel. Noong nasa Claret ako, after school, manood kami yung PBA sa Ultra. Mm. San Miguel. So, kaya nung after yung UAP championship namin, nakita ko after si Danny Siegel. Medyo naman ay utak ko nung miss shot ko. <laughs> Nakalimutan mo si Jojo dun si, Wala sa utak ko. si Danny na yun. Uh, pero nung time na yun, ayaw nila ako mag-PBL. Gusto nila mag-train ako for one year sa San Miguel. Pero gusto ko rin maglaro ng PBL. That's why I played for Harbor Center. Yun. Akala ng tao noong time na yun. Buti wala ng social media. Akala nila ayaw ko mag-PBL. Ah, laki ng ulo nito. Yabang nito. Akala mo kung sino. Hindi naman nag-champion sa final year niya. Ayaw mag-PBL. Yun pala. Pinag-PBA na pala. Hindi, 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 hindi naman mag-PBA. Parang sobrang utong, laki utong lalo kay Coach Shot na binibigyan na ako ng yeah. one year to train with them. Na walang assurance na i-draft nila ako. Kasi atin, Coach Shot kasi atinista eh. Yeah. Na, alam mo yung supporta sa kapwa atinista. Wait lang, Kuya. Yung... Pag natapos pa yung UAP, kailangan ka pwede magpa-draft the following year. The following year. So, meron ka talaga bakante na halos one year. Bakante. Oh, one year. One so, year. you had a choice between practicing na for a full year against PBA guys. And this is not just a PBA team. This is hmm. San Miguel Birmen. Or, oh. play PBL na kalaban mo again. Yung mga nakakalaban mo na talaga. Yes. So, so gave you that choice. Nun, yeah, that time... So, maglaro ng PBL or mag-practice ako with San Miguel na PBA guys mga kasama mo pero wala kang laro. Yeah. Scrimmage lang. Scrimmage lang. So, sabi ng 
mga kapatid ko, family ko, maglaro kami sa TBL. Oh, o mismo yung basketball. Competition yeah, so niya. So, eh, wala ka assurance na madadraft ka ng team na yun. So, kung sa social media yun, malamang dami ng tweets. Oo, oh, patay. Yabang nito. <laughs> Baka may hashtag nito. ka pa nun. <laughs> Oo. Oh, Kasabi na, hindi kailangan ng TBL. Baka ah, ganun. Uh, hindi lang nila alam. And, siyempre, hindi mo naman masasabi yun. Na, oh, hindi naman, yeah. wala namang post nun sa Friendster. Eh. Hindi masyado maaarad. Oo. Oh, <laughs> <time yun. laughs> so, uh, Harbor Center. And this was the strong Harbor Center. Ah. This was like, Jason? Jason Castro, Bo, Bo Belga. Ah, Aranya. Ito yung ano yung uh, madayang Harbor Center dati. <laughs> uh, super team yun eh. Si Boss Mikey. All-star. <laughs> si Boss Mikey. Naka-pitong championship yata sa ano. Yeah. Yun yung NLEX Harbor before Center. NLEX sa D-League. Dati oh, D-League. D-League. Yes, Tapos naka-Wellcoat. Yes. Wellcoat muna. Oh. Tapos Harbor Center. Well uh, Tapos Harbor. NLEX. Yun yung mga ano yun. Jervin Gako. Jervin yata. Pitong championship. Seven championship sa PBL. Eh. Harbor Center. Hanggang kayo. Nagcha-champion pa. <laughs> Oh, congrats. <laughs> grabe yung final shot ni Marky. Oh, grabe yun. Okay, so, you told Coach Chot na maglalaro ka na lang muna ng PBL. And then, entering the draft. What was that like? What was that experience like? Even though siguradong pick ka naman, alam mo naman yun. But like, the uncertainty of where you're going, alam mo na ba kung saan ka mapupunta nun? Hindi, hindi ko alam. The time na yun sa Robinson's uh, Ermita, ang lamig ng pawis ko papunta dun eh. Kasama ko yung parents ko. Hindi ko alam. Siyempre, uh, kung sa ka-team mapupunta, il- pang ilang pick ka. Siyempre, kahit na may narinig ka, may nababasa ka, pag hindi mo narinig yung pangalan mo, wala pa yun. So, yeah, 2007, I was drafted by Air 21, fourth pick. Kasunod ko si Doug. Number one pick nun si Jody Vance and Sam Samigi Eman and then Ryan Reyes. Top three. You went number yeah. four. And then Doug so, was five, uh, four. Five. Ken Bono, number six. Kenyahan, seven. Lakas, lakas din yung class din yun nun. Uh, eight, nine, ten. Si Maki is called on in Ginebra. Uh, so, when you entered the league, Air 21, this was Ranidel de Ocampo, Air 21? Oh, uh, Ranidel, Arwin Santos. Winnie. Winnie Arboleda. KG Canaleta. Starstruck Gary na naman. David. Star-struck. Gary David. Gary David. <laughs> Homer C, oh Irvin gosh. Soto. Nandun na si Ren Ren? Wala pa. Wala Ay, na din, si Ren Ren. Wala na. Lumipat na siya. Uh, talking text. Wala, na. Na, lumipat TNT na si Ren TNT Ren. Na siya. So this was yeah. the Air 21 yung ganito, di ba? Yung jersey oh, nyo. Yung <laughs> uh, violet. First day practice, dinaktakan ako ni KG Canaleta. <laughs> <laughs> Nakalaban mo si KG sa ano, UAP? Nabuta mo? Ah, nabutang ko si KG nabutang sa UE. Pero um, syempre, iba na pag ilang taon na sa UE, sa PBA. How was that, ano na naman, that adjustment? Like, PBA na to. PBA na to. PBA, iba na. Ibang ano na. Ibang laban. Kala mo kumpiyansa ka PBL, kala mo kumpiyansa ka UAP. Pero iba. Iba. Sobra. You have to prepare. You have to yeah. train. Talagang day in, day out. Mentally, physically. Yeah. Kala nila ganun, ganun lang. Pero may hirap din. May hirap na masarap. Oh, may hirap na masarap. Bayad naman si Le, so okay lang din. Yung hirap naman, may, ginha- may ginhawa naman yun. <laughs> but, but from Air 21, you, 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 ano na ba agad? BMEG after Air 21? I don't know. Air 21, the rookie year ko, after one conference, I stopped for two conferences. Wow. Hindi ko na kompleto yung rookie year ko. Uh, nagkaroon ako ng case doon sa skin. Nag-block yung pores ko. Rare disease siya. So, bago ko pawisan, mamamagana yung balat ko. Magpapantal na akong ganyan. So, ang kasunod doon, he stroke. So, Sayo. I stopped for six months. Five doctors tumingin sa akin, specialist. So, hindi nila madetermine ko ng condition ko. I took uh, antihistamine, uh, iba-ibang gamot. Hindi, hindi ako gumagaling for six months. And hindi mo so, alam saan galing? Hindi ko alam kung saan galing. First time ang, alam ko lang, Ang alam ko lang, rookie year ko, Air 21, we went to China for 10 days. Naglaro kami doon. Pagbalik ko, may condition na ako, skin disease. And ikaw lang? Yes, ako lang. So, that time, after one conference with Air 21, akala ko, I signed for three years, ha? Rookie year. Akala ko hindi ko na matatapos yung first year ko sa PD. So, ganun ka, traumatizing. So, there was so after a... six months, bumalik yung pawis ko. So, there was a thought na talagang wala na, you're done. Wala na. Akala ko wala na ako sa basket. Kasi As wala in... talaga eh. Wait, wait, wait. So, kunyari, lalaro ka? Hindi ako papawisan. 
As in, sobrang dry nung balat mo. Imagine, parang... Kahit nakakalaro ka na? Hindi. In, kahit maglaro ako, hindi kaya after 30 minutes. Magpa-pass out ako. Ah, kasi hindi, hindi lumalabas. As in, nag-block yung pores mo. Sobrang init na ng katawan mo. Sobrang kate. Tatakbo ka sa shower. Cold shower. Para mawala yung kate. Hindi mo siya makakamot sa labas. Ganon. Wild. Ganon. Ah. So, actually, may tumawag sa akin NU player a few years ago. Ganon same condition. Nagpatulong sa'yo. Tinanong ko nung ginawa ko. Sabi ko, pag muna i-try sa doctors. Nothing against doctors. Hindi nila alam ko yung condition. I tried alternative medicine. Herbal, tawas, holy water, naligo ako. Lahat ginawa ko. Lahat ginawa ko. Grabe dasal ko nun. Sabi ko, sabi ko, Lord, gusto kong makabalik sa basketball. Lord, please. The, the, this isn't went, just basketball career. Like, yes. buhay mo. Oh, hindi ka na papawisan. Oh, I, I went to Pangasinan. I went to Pangasinan. Isang church doon. Alam ng mom ko yun eh. Naligo ako ng holy water doon. Hindi lahat ng Pinoy naniniwala sa Milagro. Pero doon naniwala. Naligo ang no holy water. Way. Pero hindi ako, hindi lumabas kagad yung pawis ko. Ano lang. Konti-konti lang. Sa ulo, chest part, lower body. Konti ko, paunti-unti lang that time. Nakabalik ako sa sophomore year ko sa PBA, second year ko. Doon ako nakabalik. So, so After six ko. months. So ano ka na noon? <laughs> Kumbaga hopeless, desperate ka na, punta kang pagkasinan. Yes, oo, oh, oh, lahat, lahat ginawa ko noon. Para ano. Wild. So himala. Yeah. Walang himala. <laughs> wala, walang himala. Yan, yun yung wow. time na yun. Yeah. Again, wala sa social media yon. Wala sa social media, yeah. <laughs> Pumunta, siya, pumunta ka ng Pangasina, naligo ko sa holy water. Then when you came back, <laughs> eventually, bumabalik na, bumabalik na. Sa steroids, even steroids. Steroids, hindi, hindi na kaya. Man, kung umabot sobrang, ka na sa steroids, sobrang sinubuka mo na lahat. Lahat, lahat. Hindi kaya. Lahat, lahat. So, hindi doktor din ang nag-heal sa'yo? Just then? Yes, of course. Yeah. That's crazy. Yeah, it's crazy. Anyway, yeah. After, my sophomore year, na-trade na ako sa Enebra. Wow. Na. But the feeling of being Now, back, though, Uh-oh. Finally being able to play again. Siguro, nung pawis po, bumabalik-balik na paunti-unti. Ano ka na? No? Uy, may konti na. <laughs> Oo, oh, saya ko nun. Balik basketball nun. Hinebra na. So for me, year. Glad you're with us tonight. Zep Samantha here with Jason Webb. Oh, that managed to wiggle open in Taz being sent by that early duo technical call as in Taz nails the three. First set of points. Let's get made with that attempt. Those are foul defying shots as this guy is already in the semis with a win against Reno Chai 95-85 closing out that series in time Ginebra so, though was an experience for sure that was Fast and the Furious uh, Ginebra yes so uh, that time they were injured uh, nakalaro kami nakalaro ako noon injured yung superstars na da. and then yun kasabay ang sila Ronald Tubid Eric Mink Johnny A. Nandun, si Kuya Johnny. Johnny A. Sunday Salvation. Wow. Experience na naman yun. Yeah. Junti Valenzuela. Uy, si Junti daw ang yeah. pinakamabait na player. Ha? Wala daw kasalba-salbay sa katawan ni Kuya Junti. <laughs> Sakit ang katawan ko noon, Hinebra. Kaliwa, Junti, kanan, Ronald Tubid. <laughs> Sakit sa katawan. So, sabi sa akin ni Kuya Bo, si Kuya Junti daw ang pinaka, ano, pasimple, simpleng oh, simple lang. Mabayat sobra, yeah. pero simpleng simple lang talaga, bigla na lang may masakit sa'yo. <laughs> pero grabe respect ako doon kay Junti. Napakatali ng player. Kaling nun? Si Junti. Kaling nun dati. But you're, you can say that you got your, obviously you got your championship with BMEG. BMEG, oh, for Hinebra. That was your first championship in the league. Yes. Uh, nung Hinebra naman ako, dalawang finals yata kami nun. Talo yeah. kami sa Miguel. Oh, yung, yung, yung dapat nung ka na nag-e-ensayo. <laughs> <laughs> Talo. Game 6 yata yun eh. Tapos yung isa, Hinebra versus TNT. Talo din kami sa finals. Nasa si Coach Talo. Chuck nun, si TNT. <laughs> oh, yeah. Ta- oh, Nasa TNT Coach siya. Yeah, yeah. <clears throat> Who was the coach of Hinebra that time? Sorry, Kuya. Coach Nung Jong. Ikaw. Chico. Coach Jong with Chico. Coach Jong. Yeah. Grabe mga coaches na dinaanan mo ah. <laughs> uh, Puro Jung. legend. And yeah. then sa Air 21 nun? Coach Bo, pero sa all. Ay si Coach Bo. Okay, Coach uh, Bo. Yeah, eh. Coach, Coach Bo. Bo. Coach okay, so, yeah. and then ito na. Team Cone, James Yap, Mark Pingris, yes. PJ Simon. PJ Simon. Uh, Rafi Rivis. Ina, champion. Rafi. How was that experience Josh like among with Coach Tim? Josh Rubiston. Jonas Villanueva. Actually, that time, ayoko umalis na Hinebra. 
Sobra. Sino ba ayaw umalis? Sino ba gusto umalis sa Ginebra? Wala. And then, hindi ko alam na doon pala magka-champion sa Pure Food, sa D-Link. Oh, sa D-Link. So, that time, Kirby, Kirby Raimundo got traded to Ginebra. Ako yung nalipat sa BMEG. BMEG. And when you got to BMEG, ano, loaded. Oh. Si James Yap. <laughs> James, PJ, sabi ko, ready ako sa role na backup. James Yap yun eh. PJ Simon yun eh. Ano pa bang ano? <laughs> ano nilalaban si P- mo dun? Di ba si PJ nga off the bench pa? Uh, oh, super sub. <laughs> super sub. So, ko. Uh, kay coach team kasi, alam mo, short rotation si coach team. Yeah. 15-man lineup, 8 to 9 players gagamitin niya. Ang goal mo every practice to compete against your teammates. To make it to the 8-man rotation. 8 to 9. So, pupunta ka practice, body-body kayo ng mga teammates mo. Pero sa utak ko nun, paggawan tayo ng playing time. Na ganun sa PBA, to yeah, be honest. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Of course. Pero at the same time, positive din nangyayari sa team mo kasi nag improve kayo lahat. Oo oh, naman. Competition sa practice. Walang... So, wala. Kahit si na James Yap nun talagang... Walang relax sa lahat. Oo, oh, oo. Oh, oh. Pero so, si James, pag gumalaw niya, kala mo relax lang, pero nakatodo eh. <laughs> Totoo, to. pag ganun-ganun lang eh. Pero... <laughs> no, pero ibig sabihin, your practices were entertaining to watch din. Kasi kung bakbakan kayo, para kayong ano nun. Oo, oh, PJ, James, pag panoorin mo sa practice, grabe. Mark Jordan Payne, Chris. Jordan eh. Payne pa. Ah, so sila yung nagmamatch up? Ah, si James and Payne. First group sila nun eh. Second group no, no, no. I mean, nilaan. si PJ tsaka si... James, James, sa practices? No, magkakampi sila first first unit. Uh, so you would be the one na talagang bakbaka kayo ni James Yap? Hindi, uh, hindi, hindi kaya sabayan yun. Hindi <laughs> <laughs> bakbaka na si like, compete. Hindi uh-huh. kaya sabayan yun. Sakto <laughs> ano lang, sakto ano, lang. Ano ka rin kay James Yap? Lang. Kung baga, nabilib ka din kay oh, James Yap. Oo oh, naman, mabayad si James. Uh, oh, sobrang like, humble na gayet. Parang Jordan ng PBA yun eh. Oh, Jordan like, ng PBA yun eh. Face of the, face mm-hmm. of the league. Pero wala ka maranda may yabang kay James. Mukha naman eh. Kahit na ano. So na-enjoy so, ko rin yung BMAG years ko with them. Oh, championship ka nun eh. Sayang wala pang motor nun. Wala pang mga motorcycle <laughs> club nun eh. Totoo. <laughs> Totoo kasi <laughs> si James, si Ping, di ba? Mga oh. ano na rin, addict na rin ngayon eh. Yeah, si PJ, nag-ride na rin yan. Sa, ah, sumama na rin. Uh, and then when you entered your... Ano Ikaw, kasi, nagmamotor ka rin. Ah, nagmamotor ako. Pero ano ngayon? Oh, nalala ko. So, ah, yeah. Pero grindhouse. Like, grindhouse, yeah. Coach Aldo. <laughs> yeah. So, when you entered your... I don't want to call it the twilight years. Pero yung years na ikaw na yung senior. Ikaw na ngayon yung veterano. These were the Phoenix years. The Red Bull years. Tama? Yes. The Red Bull years. Ano ka na nun eh? Baga, Barako Bull, yes. Mainstay Barako ka Bull. na nun eh. Barako Bull. Uh, uh, mainstay ka na nun. How is that like yeah. naman na ikaw na yung... Baga, may mga mas, may younger guys naman na, na umaakit ng liga. And you were the kuya. Uh, 2015 yun eh, hindi makalimutan eh. From BMEG, I got traded to Barako Bull. Uh, to be honest, ang sama ng loob ko nun. So, hindi pa naman ako, hindi pa naman kuya yung tawag sa akin nung na-transfer ako sa Barako Bull. Pero sa sobrang sama ng loob ko nun, nag-training ako mag-isa sa US, sariling pera ko. Gusto ko mag-improve, gusto ko bumalik sa dating team ko. Ganon, ganon ka sama ng loob ko nun. Did you feel that it was a... Downfall na ng career. Yeah. Yung parang okay. Oh, yes. Yes. That time, sabi ko, shit. Parang okay. Feeling ko buwan bagsak na yung daro ko. Ba't naman ako trade di ba? Ganun sa PBA. Pag hindi ka nagpapakita, matatrade ka talaga. Mm-hmm. So, nung Barako Bull, sabi ko sa girlfriend ko noon, ngayong wife ko, sabi ko, mawawala ako ng two weeks, punta akong states, magka-train ako mag-isa. So, Barako Bull, grabe yung kumpiyansa ko noon. As in, Iba yung kumpiyansa ko nun. To the first half, pero ang Barako, looking to be... Big... Oh! JC and Thaw with a throw there. And they're hoping that Sol can light things up for Barako. And a nice feed. So Sol Mercado, basket earlier. Ngayon, feed naman kay JC. JC, lalapit. Floater is good. Good with decision by JC. Just had too many turnovers. They had 22 miscues. And in this particular game, do or die ito. They need to win the win. Small margin of errors. So, the, yun yung time na nakuha ko ng Gilas. Napansin ako ni Coach Tab. After Barako Bowl, uh, after Gilas, balik akong Barako Bowl, pinakuha niya ng Phoenix. Doon ako tumagal. Six, seven years na. Yeah, I think Barako Bowl, that was your, individually, yun yung best years mo eh. Individually. Uh, 
Yes, yes. In terms of your stats and everything. Na talaga, uh, ano. Ibang binigay din confidence sa ni Coach Koy, Coach Bong Ramos. It's another turnover. It's committed here. In foul down the middle for the beautiful finger roll. Very nice pass, guy. Pride 40 plus champions choose golf. Kakabawi naman doon sa kabilang panig. Alabi handoff para kay JC Intal. Intal has to get going here para sa kanyang opponent. And of course, the jumper. Jake to John Dan. Salvador, papasok kay Intal. Intal to the fadeaway. That's good for JC. That's a nice cut there from the weak side. And where... Uh, yan, hanggang sa... Naging kuya na ako sa Phoenix. Doon na ako tumagal dito. Barako Bull, Phoenix na ako tumagal. Yeah. Yun ang ano ka na. Kung baga, stay na ako dito because of the oh. management, of course, yung mga people oh, yes. around you. Hindi ka na oh. din umasam, umalis na kasi okay na ako. Yes, And yes. Wala na. Wala technically, na. yung punta mo sa States, na. yung goal mo was to get traded again yeah. somewhere oh. else. Oh. Plano ng yeah. Diyos sa'yo talagang ano. Oh, mga hindi so mo yung expect <laughs> oh. Ito na. Seven years na ako tumagal sa Phoenix para Let's talk about your gila stint. Kasi kasama ka doon sa cooking show eh. <laughs> oh, gila uh grabe yun. Uh, first time ko na experience na talagang they took advantage. Talaga bang malala? Malala eh kasi lahat ng games namin doon maaga yung bus driver ready na to go to the game venue from our hotel ah and then fi- gold medal game wala in driver hindi makita. Siyempre, naka-uniform na kami nun eh. Ready to warm up na sa ano eh. Tagal. Siguro mga 30 minutes bago na natin bus driver. Pagdating namin sa game venue, lahat ng kasama namin, usually no, umupo sa selected ng bench eh. Wala, hiwa-hiwala yung tickets nila. And then round robin, sira yung net namin. Hindi kami makapag-warm up. Ang ginawa namin, nag-warm up sa court nila. Sabay kami nag-warm up sa court nila. Ginagawa yung net namin. Tapos lahat ng Chinese, dirty finger. Eh, hindi namin naiintindihan eh. Basta yeah. narinig ka, fuck, fuck you, fuck you, fuck you. Number nine, number. Si Calvin yung number one tinitira <laughs> ng mga Chinese. Si Calvin, abo, abo. Sabi ko, grabe. Bata ni Andre Blatch, parati nasa record ng pension doon sa taas. As in, hiwa-hiwalay lahat ng tickets nila. Sabi ko, kakakaiba to. Kaya That galit was... na galit si Coach Hat, galit. Sa oh. Nag-warm up kayo talaga sa tabi nila? <laughs> Oo, oh, hindi sa court nila. Sabay kami nag-warm up. Oo, oh, kung baga nag-round oh. rock yung pareho kayo. <laughs> Buti na lang hindi nagkasunto ka. <laughs> Buti na lang walang gulo. Buti na lang. Yung Pero low-key, medyo mainit na. Oo. Oh, Nagkakainit na na kayo. Mainit na. Oh. Grabe. <laughs> Grabe yung game na yun. Pero okay pa rin. Nag-silver, nag-silver in second place. You could have won the gold though kung hindi oh, sila nag-ganon-ganon oh, doon. Oh. Ito Pero, yung talaga lahat yes. tinitira na ni Calvin. <laughs> Oo, oh, lahat. Gusto nang balian ang buto lahat ni Calvin. Eh. Pero gra- ang lakas, lakas din ng China ng time. Eh. Iba, iba rin yung lineup nila. Yeah, but three it would have... 3NBA guys ba? Yeah, 3NBA guys. Si na ano? Yi. Si na Yi, di ba? But when Point I... Re- oh, yeah, I remember when we were all here talagang iba eh. And... Iba, iba yun. Yung, yung, yun lang, like yung balita na yung bus, yung warm up, lahat yun were... Yeah. Grabe yun. Grabe yun, China, and an experience yun. And... Oh, an offensive rebound though. From Toss. Itself makes the three, moves inside, lovely move. With the rebound. Moves it forward to Norwood, who hangs it up there. And a pretty finish from JC Intel. This is yeah. low-key one of the teams na favorite ng maraming tao because this was the year na ang daming nag-decline. Tama ba? You know, at parang at, di lahat na superstars ng PBA nandun. Exactly. Parang mga role, mga role players. And then, I know, I'm a role player. Si Don, Kuya Don Don, medyo may edad na at that time. So, sorry. Ha? Kuya A, si Terrence, grabe si Terrence nun. Calvin, grabe na time yun. Matthew, Matt Canuelas, he was Canuelas. there. Yeah. Gabe, of course, Gabe. So means the... Ranidel. Ranidel. Yeah. yeah. So, yung ibang players, para nag-decline, may family matters yata. So, swerte na rin kami, nasama kami. Kung di, dahil, kung di sila nag-decline, hindi kami nang makasama din. So, And, yeah. Kaya nga, kaya I believe this was, a, was this was one of the favorites. Eh. Kasi yun din yung time na parang hindi na padala yung best possible lineup. Mm-hmm. Diba? And what then you if, make what if what if uh, and you made it all the way to the final. Hindi, actually, yung what if lang naman dyan, finals, kung hindi uh, kayo ginanon nung China. <laughs> yung lang ang what if dyan. No? 
Kasi malakas pa rin Sorry. naman yung team ninyo eh. <laughs> Parang y- yung time yung Olympic qualifier yun eh. Kayo, kayo. Ano yung ano dyan? Ano umit ko nun? Si Sunny eh. Sabi ko. Okay, sa- Sunny Toss. He was there. Sunny Toss. Yeah, Sunny Toss. Sabi ko, no, what if we get this gold medal? Diba? Grabe. Sabi ko, ready ako magpatato ng Olympic rings eh. Hindi, diba? Kahit nag-qualify ka lang. Na Oo oh, naman. Shortcut. Shortcut lang. Diba? Pupunta ka pa din ng Olympics. <laughs> Oo. Grabe yun. Pero yun, yun, parang yun yung last time na na ano, qualifier. Window. Yeah. Tsaka yung ganun ka dikitan. Uh, ngayon, mas mahirap na yata. Mas yun. mahirap na ngayon. Eh. But after the game though, was it easier to recover from? Or medyo matindi? Sorry, wait lang. Go lang, go lang. Eh. Okay, why, why are you crying? Ah, okay. Bye. With me? Yeah. Bye. Daughter ko. Sabi ko sa inyo eh, Kuya JC is gonna live his best life now. <laughs> Ngayon, naniniwala ako best life. Uh, more family time. I mean, it's a bittersweet for me, pero more family time. Oh, uh, miss ko yung basketball, pero the time with my kids, our kids, sobra. And this is the time for you to enjoy everything you worked for. Diba? Yes. Yes. Uh, well, yeah. fast forward tayo dun. Uh, okay na yun. Uh, fast forward tayo ngayon sa kwentuhang retirement. Where did the decision come from? Was it already in your head the past couple of years? Did the pandemic have anything to do with it? I believe so. That the pandemic would have something yeah, to do with it. Yes. Big factor then. Uh, when I was in the bubble, PBA bubble in Clark, every, every single day I miss my family. My kids, most especially. And iba, iba experience yung bubble eh. Parang ang tayong maisip eh. And sobrang thankful ako na kasi my goal was to stay in the PB for 10 years. And then bonus na lang sa akin itong 3-4 years eh. Gusto ko, my, my, to be honest, my goal is 15 years. Parang tatlong UAP, 5-5-5. Pero if hindi nangyari itong pandemic, baka pinush ko pa ng pinush. And you're Kahit not... Hindi na ako isign ng team. Baka mag-tryouts pa ako sa ibang teams. And you're not not in shape eh. You're not <laughs> not in shape na nag-retire ka because you couldn't play anymore or may injury ka or pagod ka na. No, it, uh, ibang-iba lang talaga yung bubble. People don't understand how iba, tough it is to be siya. in the bubble. Oo. Uh, iba. Sobra iba. Kasi no regular day, kuya, pwede ka mag-insayo tapos uuwi ka sa pamilya mo. <laughs> yes. Uh, yun talagang hotel, court, hotel, court. Kasi mga gym nakikita, sa baba. Mga nakikita mo lang yung mga hinayupak na teammate mo. Di ba? Na parang <laughs> kayo na naman. JR. <laughs> kayo na naman. Pero uh, in fairness, hindi. Ang ganda experience yun talaga. As in, oh. roommate ko pa, best friend ko. Di ba? That's true. Yeah, And I'm sure kayong dalawa ni Kuya JR noon talaga nagre-reminisce lang din kayo. For, like... Oo. Oo naman. Usapang retirement na rin yung topic namin. <laughs> Usapang so, retirement. So doon mo sa bubble medyo naiisip na na hindi ko na kaya oh, to na. ulit to. Hindi ko na kaya ulit gawin siguro, to. Siguro nung bubble parang 50-50. 50-50 na. Because gusto you... Pa maglaro. Gusto pa maglaro. One, two years. Gusto ko pa. So let me so, ask you... pandemic. Oh, let me ask you now. If it wasn't a bubble setup, tutuloy mo? Oh naman. Condition oh, naman. pay. Tsaka mukhang ano pa naman. Pag pinapasok ah. ka pa ng bubble, gumagawa pa eh. <laughs> Magawa pa. Kunti-kunti lang. Sure. Inacquire siya because of the size. Wanting to have some type of pressure just to make ilalim. This is a power play coming from JC. Not in the same page. Sumang on the dribble and might have dribbled too many times there. Naagaw tuloy. And JC is down. You knew he was gonna slam. Yun talaga. It's the bubble. It's the pandemic. Who has obviously affected a lot, a lot of people. Pero, de ba? Hindi naman hundred percent. Pero malaking factor din talaga yung pandemic. Yeah. Yung bubble. Parang gusto mo naman experience yung one time lang. Yeah. Just, one time. Ayaw mo nang ayaw mo nang isekod ta. Hindi na siguro. One time lang. One time lang. But the the conversation with Kuya Jr. Ano na? Kung baga ano na? Ano gagawin natin? <laughs> napapag-usapan. Napapag-usapan. And, mga times na, oh, baka pwede pa tayo one year. Baka ma-miss natin yung basketball bigla. Kasi mag iba routine mo eh. True, true. Imagine for how many years, how many years, gigising ka maaga, pag-uwi mo, kain ka, then magpapahinga ka, the next day training, may extra work pa. Uh-huh. Tsaka so, ngayon, ibang-iba yung routine. Oh. Tsaka ngayon, hindi mo na kailangan magpa-condition. Ah, kailangan pa rin, syempre. Uh, eh, pero hindi well. na technically Especially kailangan. Now. The oh, more, pero... more now because of your health, but oh, hindi na siya trabaho yes. mo. Yes, pero syempre, hindi pwede mo, hindi, hindi pwede hindi mawala. Oh, yeah. oh. And, kuya, yeah. like, 
I, I wanted to bring this up because only a few players, with how hard it is to stay in the PBA, only a few players actually reach a point that they will retire. Yung talagang legends, yung umaabot sa point na I will call it a career. Kasi usually marami, talagang nawawala na lang, hindi na pinirma, di ba? I mean, this is not a shot to anyone. Ha? Pero like, there are legends who really reach a point na Doug Kramer, just recently, di ba? Willie Wilson, sa Phoenix lang, Doug Kramer, Willie Wilson, na talagang, yeah. okay, I'm done. Looking back at your whole life, your whole basketball career, did you ever see this coming na ikaw ang aayaw na sa basketball versus yung basketball ang aayaw sa'yo? <laughs> no. Uh, never could I imagine. Yeah. As in, never. Um, okay, share ko na. Uh, before the pandemic, last year, that was Feb, nagkaroon ako ng art show, solo show. My first art show. I was into art grade school, high school, medyo ng college. Nawala na siya ng basketball. And then, nagmo-motorcycle ako latter part of my PBA career. Ah, PBA years. I met this guy, Jigger Cruz. Hindi ko alam na artist siya. So I went to his house. Nakita ko yung studio niya. Doon bumalik sa akin yung art. So I was still playing with Phoenix. Kaya nga Phoenix, Phoenix. Basketball pa rin, basketball. On the side, nagpapaint ako. Hobby. Hobby. Distress or whatever. Hanggang sa nakaipon ako ng paintings, merong isang artist na nag-cancel ng show. Inoferan ako mag-solo show. And then Feb yun. It was successful. Puta na loob ko kay Gia, SLFJ Studio, Tim Yap, and... Jigger Cruz, who's a well-known artist. Utang na loob ko sa kanila yun. And then pandemic happened. That was Feb last year. Pandemic. Stop PBA. Walang basketball. Ang ginawa ko, puro art. As in, sobrang paint lang ko lang. Kahit tinamay mga kukuha kong dudumingin yun. Paint lang ko lang paint. Yun yung parang naging big factor din na nag-decide ako mag-retire. Kasi to be honest, pwede pa ako mag... Alam mo yun... Pwede so pa, pa kuya. Magdalo. Pwede pa talaga kuya. One, one, two years gusto pa maglaro. Pero I'm sure Phoenix has other plans. They drafted five players. Wala. Ganun talaga eh. Pag sa PBA, hindi ka na ma-renew or offeran ka ng ganitong contract or ganitong liga or ano. You have to decide for yourself and choose what do you want to do with your life after basketball. So for me, this is the right time na makabuelo out, uh, after my life playing for how many years? 13 years na rin. Ayokong magde-decide kung anong gagawin ko after basketball. Right na hindi na ako mar- makapag-renew ng contract. Mm-hmm. Gusto ko may buwela na ako. Yeah. So yun yung buwela ko, yung art. So right now, ang focus ko is into art. Magkakaroon ako ng second show this April or May. Doon dun ko na pinili yung art. At the same time, kahit gusto ko pa maglaro ng basketball, for me, I know it's time to move on. And masaya din ako na nag-retire ako na medyo malakas pa, walang injury, yeah. na alam mo sa utak mo na, alam mo yun, masaya ako nag-retire. Oh, hindi, hindi you ako, weren't forced to retire. Yes, yeah. oh, masaya ako nag-retire. Pero of course, nag-sync in sa akin kahapon, Monday. I was o- so, sobrang overwhelmed ako sa mga messages. Sorry oh, yeah. for flooding my social media account, yung mga retweets or like stories. Sobrang na-appreciate ko na... Kasi bro, hindi naman ako like superstar James Yap level, Arwin Satos level, June Mar. Pero sobrang na-appreciate ko yung grabe, yung support and yung well wishes sa akin ng mga tao. Nasabi ko, kahit pa paano pala nagkaroon ako ng impact sa, sa basketball. To my amazing friend and teammate JC, congrats sa retirement mo. Siyempre, salamat din sa mga memories na you've shared Siyempre, since high school pa tayo, and until sa bubble, uh, I really appreciate how great teammate you are and a friend. Again, congrats sa'yo, Brad, and good luck sa next career mo, and hope to see you soon, brother. Stay amazing. Cap JC, uh, great career. You've done more than enough for Philippine basketball. Uh, enjoy your retirement, and hope to see you soon. Hi Jesse, uh, hindi ko alam kung magkakongrats ako sa iyo kasi nag-retire ka or hindi pero alam kong masaya ka and good luck sa future na mga gagawin mo. Alam kong magpipaint ka lang one to sawa at saka mag-ride sa motor mo. So I know you're gonna enjoy that life. Uh, just wanna say thank you also for guiding me since I was like young in the PBA hanggang ngayon. Uh, sa narating ko, uh, I wouldn't be here without you. Thank you for all the guidance and amazing. 
My favorite memory of JC is probably the first time we hung out off the court. Uh, JC is one of those guys who, when he asks, how are you, he genuinely cares how you're doing. He genuinely wants to see you win and, and succeed. And you don't come across a lot of people like that in the world who really want to help you and they're willing to share their mistakes with you uh, in order for you to be better. Yeah, that, that time we hung out off the court, like he looked me dead in, his, dead in my eyes and uh, he spoke from the heart and was honest with me. And uh, yeah, JC knows what I'm talking about. But uh, yeah, that's probably my most memorable time with Jace. Jace, brother, congrats on your great career. Um, I wish you luck on your next journey. And uh, yeah, enjoy retirement. One, two, three. Congrats, JC, on an amazing career. And I wish you all the best in your next life as a famous painter and stay-at-home father. Congratulations, JC, my forever teammate on an amazing career. Um, you inspired so many players throughout the throughout the years that you've played. Um, I just want to wish you a happy retirement, and I'm pretty sure that you're going to be very, very busy um, post-career. Um, good luck and God bless. Abe, at um, yun, at uh, nagpapasalamat ako na naging teammate kita, naging body kita, at um, higit sa lahat, naging diretso ka sa amin ng mga teammate mo at uh, magpapasalamat ako na yun, natupad na lahat ng pangarap mo at um, ready ready ka na talaga magretiro at um, yun ingat lagi, God bless, see you soon abe Good day mate nah. Hi JC aka The Rocket um, congrats on a successful career um, I knew you had it in you we all knew it. You're always the Michael Jordan of our group. Uh, we all looked up to you. And um, I'm just very blessed that I was a part, a small part of that journey. Um, but we'll take those times and memories uh, with us forever. But um, again, congrats, JC. God bless on your career, after your basketball career. Um, I know you'll do really well in everything you do. Um, it's just the way you are. Um, God bless, bro. Hello, Jace. It's uh, me again. Um, if I were to pick um, a favorite memory of mine, the struggle is real. Because ang dami naming memories together, you know, from entering Ateneo 2002 to even, I remember even non basketball where we would uh, have our tutorials at Pollock Center in Ateneo taking our summer classes we would be classmates in a lot of uh, in, in a lot of classes I remember winning our 2002 championship even though we didn't play that much but it was our only championship then but siguro the most special memory I have with JC is even though we failed uh, it was our 2006 Ateneo versus UST uh, championship and I remember very distinctly how JC dominated the, the whole series and it came down to the last two shots uh, of game three and he took it in his hands. Um, it didn't work out but I remember our our last embrace as Blue Eagles waving goodbye to Ateneo. Parang it was a culmination of five years of playing for our beloved school and alma mater and the journey of the failures and the successes and then targeting to reach the PBA together. Uh, Pinag-usapan namin ni JC na parang our, our goal is to make it 10 years in the PBA but you know God's grace is you know as it as what it means is undeserved gift and we were able to last more than 10 years and it's a beautiful journey because I started my my basketball career in Ateneo with JC and made it to the PBA together 2007 and finished the PBA almost at the same time you know one year apart lang with the same team also at Phoenix so there's a lot of in-betweens a lot of memories but more than that it's the brotherhood that we share and the bond that we've uh, you know we've parang kung ano yung friendship namin is what what will last more than basketball and that's why JC Congratulations on a very, very fruitful and beautiful career. Um, next chapter, bro. Uh, new house, uh, new art career on the side. 
I'm very excited for you and maybe baby number three with Bianca. So I love you, bro. God bless. Kuya, oh, nagkaroon grabe. ka ng impact, yeah. kuya. Nagkaroon ka ng impact. Hindi, <laughs> 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 sobrang saya ko lang kasi kahapon lang nag-sync in sa akin na ako kay Dizit, Goodbye Basketball. Imagine 20 years of doing what you love. Ito isang love ko naman, i- ibang passion naman to which is hard. I think yeah. I think it's focus. also yeah. another blessing na oh, no, no. to find no. another passion. And that's something that basketball players, retired basketball players struggle with na parang ano na ngayon wala na hindi na ako pupunta ng ensayo wala nang game wala nang pinaghahandaan marami kang like, let's face it straight up marami kang pera pero ano na ngayon what now and I think I'm ma- sure marami yan uh, mahalap nila yan um, uh, but that's an inspiration na talagang especially now especially now you're just at home you got pwede yung bus most of the time marami so, so you're an artist <laughs> rookie rookie artist No, but then he, that was your passion since you were younger. Yeah. Yes, but yeah, nawala lang nung time na So now you're gonna make it a career. Hopefully, hopefully. That is mm-hmm. great. Kaya pala si Rex yeah. mahilig din. Yeah, mas magal pero mas magaling si Rex sa nagpaint. Uh, I mean to abstract painting. Rex is portrait. Mas grabe, mas detailed siya magpaint. Wow, man. Yeah. Sobrang ano mo, sobrang swag. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Sobrang swag, yeah. man. I mean, just to find another passion na sabi nga parang people say ball is life, ball is life, ball is life, but there really comes a point na, na like you can't have other passions. Diba? And I'm sure your family din, di ba? More time with the family. I'm sure you consulted yeah. with your whole family before you made the decision. Kaya yeah, pala sobrang course. gaan mo. Oo. Oh, magaan sa loob. Oo, oh, kung bagaan. Siyempre, nangihinayang ka, oh, pwede pa ako. Pero then, parang Bago ka matulog, alam mo na, okay, mag-art na ako. Pero, okay, okay tayo. Oo. Kanina, galing ako sa art studio. So, di ba Parang ako Kobe, sa... po, tick, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Kanina, yeah. Parang kumbaga, uh, like... Oh my gosh. Yeah, may mga tinatapos ako sa ano kanina. I'll show you a photo. So, there will come hmm. a point that you will be known as an artist, not a basketball player. Hopefully, magdi lang ang ka sana. <laughs> Hindi kasi isipin Pero mo. Pero sobrang daming Pinoy's na ano, sobrang magaling na artist talaga. Na. Isipin mo kuya, yung mga bata ngayon na hindi ka kilala. Tapos pag tumanda sila, tapos gumaling kang artist. Ang kilala nila si <laughs> JC Italio artist. Tapos lahat kami parang, anong artist? Ganyan siya, mga abstract. abstract Wild, artists. man. A hooper made that. Yun yung isipin niyo like, a hooper <laughs> made that. Hoopers have other talents and other passions in I can just imagine talaga na kunyari yung anak ko that will come out in seven years eight years <laughs> tapos sabi niya sa akin na kunyari into art siya tapos uy dad yung JC Intel galing na artist bakit bato ka dahil <laughs> magaling ha sila Kelly Williams magaling magpaint ha yun Kelly. na nga tapos isipin mo sila parang artist si Kelly Williams baka bato ka kayo mo hindi mo ba kailangan si The Rocket tsaka si Machine yun yung, Gun yun yung, yung mahirap yun yung mahirap challenge din na uh, yun yung challenge for me na paano ihiwala yung sarili ko sa basketball kasi oh imam mundo yung art eh. ibang mundo mas, ma, mas malawak na mundo yun tsaka ano ka dyan ibang... kuya paglipat mo dyan talagang baguhan ka hindi kasi JC Intal sobra sobra <laughs> Sino ka? Parang, Parang ang galing letra na pumunta ulit natin na yun yan. <laughs> Oo, oh, sobra. Kaya for me, parang magamit ko yung basketball years ko na kahit anong trash talk mo or mura sa'yo ng fans. Magamit sa art world yun. Na, pag, sinabi nila, pag sinabi nila pangit yung gawa mo, <laughs> Dutch, tibay ako. Okay lang. <laughs> okay lang. lang. <laughs> Nag-i-enjoy okay ako eh. Oh. Okay lang. Okay But okay lang. Um, sobrang inspiration nun na ang saya, man. I'm so excited for you, Bigla. Parang hindi na ako na ano dun sa retirement mo. Parang na-excite ako para sa sa'yo. Na. <laughs> Punta ka sa ano, show ko ah, sa April. Pupunta ako. Kayo, sigurado. Iya. Sigurado. Man, so swab ano. Swab muna tayo, swab. <laughs> oh, sige. Pero wild. Antigen, antigen muna sa labas. Yeah. Galing, man. So ano ka na ngayon? Yeah. You're excited for... Sabi ko ni, eh, nung tinex kita, sabi ko, sigurado ko your post-retirement would be even ah. better than your ano eh. Excited din, excited. Nagbago tuloy ko siya. Kaya tinitignan kita, artist na nakikita ko. <laughs> <laughs> excited sa artwork. Kaya pala nagpahaba ng buhok. Tapos ngayon, may ano na siya. Artist na siya ngayon, ma. Hippie na, hippie. Hippie na siya, sobra. Sobra. Okay, may bagong... I'll share my new tattoo pala. 
Idol ko na artist yan. Oh my God. Artist na siya na yan. Siya na drawing yan. My, my idol, Jigger Cruz. I my, am so... My kumpare. I am so inspired by all this, man. Yung, idol ko yan. Guys, isipin ninyo ha. A guy who made a fucking career out of basketball is kumbaga magaan pa sa kanyang mag-walk away sa game and talagang mag-focus sa ibang bagay. Sobrang... Hindi, hindi naman sobrang gaan. Grabe ka naman. Pero hindi kasing bigat ng... If you didn't know what you were gonna do na, like, what now? ba diba? Sobrang sobrang magigising ka sa umaga ng may motivation ka pa rin. Kahit mawala bigla yung basketball. Na talagang... Yeah. Pero sobrang ano, yeah. Shout out to Jigger Cruz. My, Jigger. my mentor, my coach in art. So, Jigger Cruz is the team cone of the, ano, <laughs> the art world. For me, one top 10 siya sa Philippines na kilalang artist. Utang na loob ko sa kanya yung art. So, you fell in love with it again? Yeah, yeah of course. So, first this is the first time. Na, para, whoa. This art <laughs> Hindi na rubber shoes ang tinitignan mo ngayon. <laughs> sa ano, ah, my, bro, sa basketball, may ginagaya tayong moves. Yeah. Diba? Uh, sa art, ginagaya ko din siya. So, ang daming issues. Pero, sabi ko, hindi pala pwede ganito sa art world. You have to, uh, parang, find your own style. Yeah. Ibang mundo. Very challenging. More challenging than basketball. So, ano ka ngayon? For me, ah. Your, your, your day is filled with art activities na ngayon. Yes, yes. Ano yesterday, yesterday and today, I, I was in my art studio the whole day. Ah, meron ka na din? Yeah, yeah. Ah, meron na din. Mm-hmm. So, hindi na basket yung pinupuntahan niya. Hindi <laughs> na. Uh, Sobrang sayo ko sayo para sayo ko, yeah. Sobrang thank you, thank sayo you, bro. para sayo and I'm Salamat. I'm ano, inspired that. Enjoy home. ako dito sa conversation natin. Thank you, Kuya. Pero so, dali lang, Kuya. Chill lang. Oh, sobrang chill lang to. I edit ko to. Tas Kuya, wait. Bigyan kita ng time to say, you know, yeah. to say your thanks to everyone and like wala wala akong masabi dun sa mga pinagdaanan mo hanggang ngayon. Gulo pa lang ba? Go. Sige. <laughs> Uh, bro, thank you for inviting me to your show. Uh, sobrang enjoy ako and to all the subscribers of Mikey. Uh, marami salamat for viewing this long episode and thank you for taking time. And to all my PBA fans, supporters, bidang, sobrang thank you from the bottom of my heart. Especially yesterday, I was so overwhelmed with all your messages, all your tags, photos, videos. Hindi ko alam na ganun. And I'm just very happy right now na to retire from basketball. And I'm looking forward for all the challenges coming in my way. And maraming maraming salamat sa inyo. And to my former teammates, coaches, my colleagues in the PBA, high school, basketball, college. Thank you for everything. Sa lahat ng samahan, uh, kita-kits sa lang after the pandemic. And thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Bro, Mikey, maraming salamat, bro. Yeah, maraming maraming salamat. Sobrang dami mong na, 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 na-touch na buhay or na-inspire na buhay nang hindi mo alam. Pero I'm just so excited to put this out and really just fix this whole thing, this whole video para talagang malaman nila yung buong story mo. And sobra, sobra. Ako mismo na-inspire ako. Sobra excited kong i-share yung story mo. Salamat, bro. Galing, galing, galing. Sobra excited ako para sa'yo. Hopefully, ano, I Thanks. get that invitation to your art show. Oh, hindi. Tsaka hangout tayo minsan sa studio. Saan mo si Papi Aldo. Sobrang ano yeah. na. Sobrang. Uh, ano na yung tingin ko sa'yo ngayon, Kuya? Like, uh, artist plus. na. <laughs> artist na ngayon. Artist na. Ball goes to JC Intal. Intal leaves Mark Agustin. All the way! The Rocket crossing over first. And the Rocket launching... Yun yung crossover na naiwanan si Mark Agustin at JCA the...